Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If it's your first time here, my name's Jen and I'm a self-taught nail enthusiast. And in today's video, I'm gonna be unboxing this Nail Boxy subscription box. One of my subscribers tipped me off about this company in the comment section of my last two videos and I just had to go out and snag this thing up and check it out for myself. So, why don't you guys stick around and let's see what I got. Let's get into the video. Okay, a couple people had commented about Nail Boxy in the comment section of my last few videos. I just wanted to see how it compared to the McCart Your Nail Lab box. Nail Boxy is $29.99. You get between 5 and 10 products. Now, this is a multi-product curated box, so you could get products from all different brands, and that's what I like about it. I feel like you will get stuff that you might not even be able to purchase unless you are a licensed nail tech. Obviously, if I'm comparing this to McCart, you're kind of comparing apples to oranges because with McCart, you're just getting McCart products. However, judging by the past boxes that I saw on Nailboxy's website, you still get the same sort of items. So you'll get some nail art items, you'll get some nail polishes, you'll get gel polish, you know, some poly gel. So you're still getting an array of products. So I think without further ado, I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to start this unboxing. And right off the bat, I got to say, I'm loving this packaging here. It looks very professional. You got like some marble sides and this beautiful embossed writing on the box. It's not just like a stock box that they like stuck a label on. It's quite pretty. And if you flip it over, it says, open now, nail goodies inside. Now, it does come in a bubble wrapped envelope, but I took it out of that already because that had my address on it. So just opening it up right away, it's wrapped up in tissue paper. Um, the one thing I noticed, I watched one video just to kind of see um, if everybody got the same thing because the way that it seemed on their website, it kind of seemed like they would get like a very, you know, they'd have like, let's take for instance, this gold foil, you know, like you could have gotten silver leaf or bronze leaf, even though it's the same product, they have different variations of it that they hand out. Now, the girl that I watched, there was like a little pamphlet on top of her box that explained all the products and I was hoping to get that because I kind of hate that like in these boxes, there's nothing that's like explaining to you what the product is, you know, the brand of it or the price of it. For McCart, I had to go on their website and like look everything up, which I was kind of annoyed with. Hopefully this was just a mistake and like the next box that I get from this company, it'll be in here. So I'm just gonna pick this gold leaf out since I already touched it. This is a huge bottle of gold leaf. This is literally gonna last me a lifetime. And it looks to be like already separated, which is nice because I've bought in like cheap ones off of like AliExpress and Amazon where it's just like a solid piece and then you have to like break it up. Yeah, but I mean, there's no brand on here so I don't know who this is by or you know, what company it's from. For all I know, you know, this could be from Amazon. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, it's nice to have. Next item, ooh, I love this stuff. I actually have one similar to this that I got um, a few weeks back because I really wanted to try this stuff out. I don't know what, what you call it, like rhinestone dust. Basically what it's meant for is for you to like cover the whole, you just kind of like dump it on your nail and you put like a gel polish down and then you pour it on your nail and you cover your nail in crystals, which sounds gorgeous. So I can't wait to try this out. As a matter of fact, Nail Boxy posts tutorial videos on their Instagram. If you don't follow them and you have this, you should go check out their Instagram because they post videos on how to use these products and like different nail looks with the products. So what I was thinking of doing was maybe like testing out one of the nail looks with the stuff that I get in my box and just seeing like if that nail look is really easy to do as a non-professional instead of doing like my own look like I did with McCart, just kind of creating a look around one of the tutorials that they show. I think that would be a cool idea, but I don't know. You guys let me know down below. And I should mention everyone basically gets the same items and they tell you what it is before you get your box. 
So I already knew, this isn't like a surprise to me really what was in here. Like I kind of already knew what I was getting. It's just the variance of what it could be. This little thing here, this is a dip powder recycling system. And if you don't know what this is, this product is pretty cool. So when you're doing dip powder or you're doing, you're applying this stuff, this actually saves the product for you. It catches the product in this little dish and then you just pull out this little scooper and you just put it back in the container. I think this is like the greatest invention ever. And I've actually been thinking about buying one since I had purchased this stuff. So it's pretty cool that I got one. There seems to be a theme obviously with this box and it seems to be nail art. What I've noticed is that they kind of do like themed boxes. It seemed like with like past boxes that I had seen on their website, they did a whole box with nail files and like nail prep. So it was like nail files, buffers, and all kinds of things like related to nail prep. And then they had, oh my God, look, there's even a funnel in here. That's cool. Cause I was about to say, I'm like, how the heck am I supposed to get this stuff back in here? It's so tiny, but that's awesome. Um, sorry, <laughs> I just like cut myself off. So they had one that was all about like nail prep and then like a previous box they had the 123 Go system by Enail Couture, which is so cool. That was like their whole box was like every little product that came in that system, which I mean, if you know anything about Enail Couture, then you know that that's a pretty good products. Um, he's like pretty famous for his system and his products. He was like one of the first jelly tip or gel nail, full nail cover tips and like gel nail extension kit. I'm pretty excited to see like future months. So these are just a pair of pointy colorful tweezers. Nothing to really say about that. Again, I don't see any brand names anywhere, which is kind of strange because I saw some past boxes of theirs where they had like Kiara Sky and that's what like, and like I said, Enel Couture, that's what kind of like drew me to this is because I thought I was going to be getting like some high end like products in the box and I don't know where any of this stuff is from. For all I know, like I said, I could go on Amazon right now and probably purchase all of this stuff myself. I'm sure that it would equal $25.99. However, it'd be nice to have a brand. So these are just some little bows. I'm just gonna dump these out in my hand so you can see them. They are Aurora bows. They just have that iridescence to them. And these are cute. Now see, this is the type of charm that I would put on my nail because it actually would fit on my nail as opposed to those like giant ones. Um, this is definitely something cute that I would wear on my nails. And in case you were wondering about my nails, I guess you're just gonna have to wait and watch the video when this comes out. But this is like my summer French nails. The next item are these pink, they don't look like glitter. They're more like pink pearls. Yeah, they're different sized to pearls. Quite nice, actually. That's a lot in there for such a little kit because they're all different sizes. So I like that. Ooh. And then we have some blue glitter. I'm not even gonna attempt to open that. Yeah, that's nice. It's just some glitter, nail glitters. You can encapsulate this type of glitter, so that's good. It's not too chunky that you can't fit it under an encapsulation. There are some gold pieces. Now, I don't really know what these, oh, these are hearts. Oh, that's cool. So these are just some gold hearts. Let me just see if I can like dump a couple out on the top so you can see them. I hope that's not too dark. That's cute. That would have been perfect for Valentine's Day. So yeah, I mean, it looks, <laughs> this is totally a nail art box. That was the theme here. Now this next product I'm really excited about because I have been dying to buy something like this, but I just, I was kind of afraid of like what I was gonna get. So these are just some paper flowers and there's also like some tropical oh my gosh there's like sea creatures and tropical animals and i don't know what this is oh my gosh there's some cherubs and some other just regular flowers that is pretty cool 
So I just thought this was like just flowers, but that's cool that there's a bunch of different stuff in here. Oh my gosh, I gotta open this one that's got like flamingos and stuff in it. That's cute. That's really cute. And where were these sea creatures when I did my mermaid nails, huh? Come on, that would have been perfect. All right, okay, and the next item is some Aurora paper. I just wanna check and see if this is like nail foil or if this is angel paper. The difference being that like you could transfer one to your nail. I think there's a little bit of both. See this one you can transfer to your nail and then this is angel paper. So that's pretty cool. So basically the difference, nail foil, you use a nail foil glue and you stick it to your nail. And angel paper, you basically cut up and you lay it in like a gel and you encapsulate that in the nail. So that's cool that they included both. Now, if you don't know, Aurora nails are like all the rage this year. That's like a big trend going on in 2021. I've seen a bunch of people do a tutorial. I did a little bit of a tutorial and I'll link the video above, but I'm thinking of redoing it because they posted a look using this stuff on um, nail boxy did posted a look on their instagram using the angel paper and it actually turned out quite nice so i am thinking i might try to recreate it and it looks like i have one final item in here and this is a compartment box that you can store some nail gems or small items and this is perfect because I've got a lot of like gems and decals that are still in its like original packaging because I don't have anywhere to put it right now or any way to organize it rather. So I'm actually quite excited to see this and you could even dump these things in here if you really wanted to just to have them organized. I gotta say I'm just gonna lay everything out here so we can just get an overall look at what I got in my box. I am actually going to be doing a comparison video with this and my McCart box, but I haven't received that yet. So I'll do an unboxing of that and then I'm gonna compare the two in depth. So overall, I'm really happy with the items that I received. I'm happy with the theme of nail art. I think I got a lot of goodies that I will definitely use. I don't think there's one item here that I wouldn't use to be honest with you or that I haven't used something similar to that before in a nail look. I'm really glad that I spent the $29.99 on this box. Do I think it's worth $29.99? Yes. If I were to add up like each one of these items, I think I paid like 10 bucks for this. One of these is probably like 10 bucks. So that's 20 bucks right there. I mean, if you were to buy this thing of gold leaf, that's probably like 10 bucks, you know, so you're probably looking at like $50 here, maybe in items. So I do think it's worth the money. Am I sad that these things don't have a name brand on them? A little bit. Like I'm sad I didn't get at least one name brand item in my first box because that was kind of what like drew me to picking this. However, I do think that everything that was included in here is a nice product. So please don't forget to subscribe so that you can see the comparison video. Go check out my social media. I am on Instagram and Twitter. I post a lot of my like updated nail looks on my Instagram page. If you are trying to see like what my upcoming videos are gonna be, that's the place to check out first. I pre-film my videos, so you'll see the nail look there before you actually see the video. I'm gonna ask you, please guys, subscribe before you leave. If you like videos like this, please give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that bell notification button so you never miss a Manny with me. Bye guys.